The Path Farms is a great example of community partnerships. The Hernando Church of the Nazarene loaned the path the use of the 10 acres almost seven years ago while waiting for capital funding to improve after the recession started. The first couple of years we struggled greatly while trying to purchase tractors and implements. It was also a struggle. As uneducated farmers running a homeless shelter, we had to learn the seasonal patterns as well as the varieties that liked our climate. After three years of more miss than hit, we worked with a private company who had a county contract using county dollars to bring in dredging from the lake system. Their job was to eliminate bad weeds from the lake, but they also brought up some of the best farming soil in the world. They literally dumped hundreds of trucks of soil on our farm. Near the same time, we found an old watering wagon that made our watering much more consistent when it did not rain. With more recent funding, we were able to purchase a water truck that was already fitted with a tank and gave us the ability to drive it on the road and at night. Also, with recent funding, the path built its own plant marker which speeds up our planting of the seedlings and a wagon that helps the clients plant the seedlings into the ground much more efficiently. These implements also helped us increase our yield with proper spacing instead of measuring by hand. The PATH also discovered last summer how to germinate seeds using water and we used two different methods the water machine germinator and mason jars. This gave us a much higher germination rate than using the soil. We then transplant the seed trays and use the greenhouse to grow out for a few weeks before planting them in the ground. This gives us several advantages, most importantly to get the seedlings strong and put the seedlings in the freshly tilled ground being weeks ahead of weeds. We now have a partnership with the Hernando Farmers Market, which helps us sell our produce at retail prices and helps with our farm cooperative, which has grown in number so that membership fees look like they will soon make us cash positive for this program and give us the ability to keep expanding programs. We would like to thank several of our sponsors for this program, including the Black Diamond Foundation, the Winn-Dixie Foundation, Women of Sugar Mill Woods, the Evangelical Lutheran Church of America Domestic Hunger Program, the Presbyterian Hunger Program, the Chatlos Foundation, Capital City Bank Group Foundation, the Hernando Church of the Nazarene, the Nazarene Compassionate Ministries, Public Supermarkets Charities, Paul and Georgia Harris and so many others.